Many cities have been deciding whether or not to keep their outdoor dining areas, which were created during the pandemic. I've enjoyed them. I have too. Yeah. Whittier has come to a split decision. The uptown area has been shut down to cars, but now it's reopening to drivers a few nights a week. And KKL 9's Rick Montanez is live in Whittier now with reaction from business owners and customers. Rick? Yeah, Pat and Leslie, there are strong opinions on both sides of this one, but you can see where the closure is, and of course, beyond it are those outdoor patios, and those have certainly helped restaurants stay afloat. But now, as you mentioned, a compromise with hopes this new plan will also help retail business. More change coming to Uptown Whittier. These outdoor patios and closed off streets will be no more, at least part time. You will see sometimes during the week, um, there's not a lot of people, um, so I understand the, the cars. The car situation is what Moses Beltran wants to come back. He's the owner of Greenleaf Botanicals. He says a long-term side effect of the COVID pandemic is a lack of traffic driving by his three-year-old business. It, it just really affected us because there's no one here. It, yeah. it, there's become a, a nickname for the place, which is a ghost town, and we want to take that away. We want to get back to what it used to be. Just last week, as the city weighed options for new permanent designs at the Greenleaf Promenade, council members voted to reopen Greenleaf Avenue to traffic. But there's a catch. It will close again Thursday through Saturday each week to allow outdoor dining and shopping. Jesus and Erica Martinez love to stroll the area and welcome the compromise. If, it's, yeah. if, it, if the business is drying up, then I guess you should open it up for cars during the week, which is like, I guess it's cool that there's a compromise. Some restaurants say the street side patios have helped boost business and they want an outdoor option. So does Mike Vacchio, who only eats outdoors right now. The pandemic has not stopped, slowed down, or gone away. And I'm vaxxed and double boosted. And I still wear my mask. The decision to shut down traffic and open outdoor dining spaces spread quickly in 2020 at cities all across Southern California. Now these cities must decide to keep them, go back to what was, or as Whittier is doing, go down the middle of the road. So the city is still working on plans on how to reopen this temporary uh, opening and closing of the Greenleaf Promenade. So there's no timeline for when that will begin just yet. And restaurants are still wondering what they'll do with those outdoor patios. Reporting live in Uptown Whittier, Rick Montanez, KCAL 9 News.